Welcome to another mega exciting five minute auto pairing. So, this kind of attack, I think we need to and hope for the best. What's his uh, ratings? Three minutes, fourteen, eleven. <laughs> Is one minute eight seven nine? Is five minute nineteen oh five being up to two zero five eight? Doesn't seem that dangerous at the moment. His profile is so his five minutes being up to two zero five eight. All right, um, and his blitz is eighteen twenty one being up to nineteen eighty four in October twenty fourteen. But he seems to have a very good position at the moment. Maybe I should have played d five just then, then start paying attention to the game for a laugh. Is knight g five possible? And take on d4. d5? Is that too risky? Knight d5, e6, knight f4, maybe I'm creating some weaknesses with knight d5. e6, knight f4, maybe I'm going to sack something. Does he play for C4 here? Keeps things uh, locked down. He's going to try and win that D5 pawn soon. So am I officially in trouble? Looks as I'm officially in trouble. After that. With nothing much to attack. Hmm. No. What did I do? Why did I do that? Um. Alright, I'm going to have to try and open up some lines. I don't know if C3 is that dangerous. I'll play G4 immediately, try and exploit his kind of. Um, he hasn't castled or anything yet. If I can open up this diagonal, protecting d5, c3, yes, but he kind of weakens some light squares. Right. Are these things a bit more, a bit more tactical, I think, now? This f file. So knight g4, bishop f4. On C3, I think I'm just going to move my queen away. I just want to get hold of some light squares. Basically, there is bishop g2 here. Yeah, C3 is starting to be dangerous. I might be getting uh, done over, of course. On F7, takes and can go for my king for a charge. So the root d3 to b3 trying to defend. H5 or b3, maybe b3. Just trying to discourage things. If I get h5 in, maybe I'm back in the game. Hmm. I think it's about king safety here. I don't know about knight c4s. I'm going to have to try and ignore that. I think knight c4. I was only going to get mated. I'm hoping he doesn't start testing me immediately with knight c4. Maybe I do take it just king a1 though. Okay, will I get time for h5? It will start to look scary for him after h5. Did 
does he play knight c4 immediately? <clears throat> knight c4 seems to be, the, for me, the scariest uh, choice here for black, trying to like, make me basically. Takes, takes king a1 maybe, but then I don't know. It's going to be dangerous in this b-file and this bishop looking down the diagonal. Uh, is he going to play it? It would be such a pain if he does. Okay, he didn't. So I might be getting some critical... This is a critical <laughs> tempo, I think. His kings are sitting target, so is mine. I'm hopeful this h1 attack is quick. Uh, queen e4... F5, Queen E6 looks crashing. Just Queen E4 looks as though it's mating. Blimey. I can't see any defense. Because of Queen E6. Yeah, that's why I think Knight C4, he had to do something there. Otherwise, it was, I think it was a do or die moment. And there's Rookie 8. <clears throat> Queen H7, the other rook to F1, it looks scary. Check. I've got at least um, 96 now threatened. Oh, he's resigned here. Yeah. Yeah, it, yeah let's have a quick look. Uh, so, yeah, I thought I was worse after what he played. And then. I think he must have blundered terribly. Let's have a look. Knight, knight d5 isn't such a clever move, I think. But we'll see. Yes, it wasn't that good. Ah, d takes. Oh, and then maybe challenge here. Is that is that a move as well? Engine session is g3. And if here, I suppose knight d5 is possible here. The way I played it, yeah, I've just let him be better here, this is not good is it, I think black's better not majorly better, the engine's a bit chilled out about it, like less than half a pawn oh that might actually be a mistake, it looks so tempting to do that here ok as if I'm not massively down now Sort of glad I didn't play C3. I think I'll be compounding things. <laughs> Mind you, C3 was mentioned there. No, no, for black. I'll be compounding things with this. Yeah, I think that just gives black a fast attack. That doesn't look too good. Oh, why is Queen D3 so much better? Intriguing oh, for 96 for this title. Really? Check. Check. Wow. What is going on here? <laughs> this, this is madness. Okay, so Queen D3 might have been better apparently. So C takes B2. Yes, why not just this? This is a fast attack. If he castles. Yeah, this this looks like the stuff he needed to go for my king. Quicker. Yeah, C2, knight C3, that sort of stuff. Although the advantage is less than the pawn making up its mind. I had thought the rook could be uh, switching into the fence like that. Um, so I think it was a sharp game under the scenes. Knight takes g4. Alright, so there's even the possibility of h5 here. Intriguing. Disposition. Not bothering to recapture stuff. Getting the queen. <laughs> there's crazy, crazy variations. Oh, blimey. I don't know. Crazy variations. 
this must be this is like a losing mistake now by this stage he has to go yeah knight c4 i thought knight c4 that was the one i was scared of intuitively just intuitively knight c4 surely he's getting a big attack oh maybe here queen takes c3 all right but queen a5 so immediately threatening mate now immediately threatening here i think the pawn is good because he can attack a2 and probably our oh, rook b2 is coming this is winning this was the way to play it look at this knight c4 so i can't really take here without getting done over because of queen a5 so it's all about a2 there and b2 it protects the pawn immediately and threatens queen b4 queen b2 Wow, what a what, what a line that is! Was that, that's something to bear in mind? So knight c4, basically, uh, I'll be in trouble. Check. I have to give up the exchange here, maybe. Looks better for black. My tax moles away. Surely. The way he played it is just a losing mistake. Yes, queen e4. It looks it looks crushing because f5, queen e6 is, is like forcing mate. Check. Yes, this looks like absolute murder. Queen takes h5 as a mate in two. All right. Let's make next move. Yes, there's no way he's defending that. So yeah, he had to really do the knight sack. It was virtually forced. This is a mate in two as well. Check. Checkmate. He had to do knight c4. It's an instructive moment. You've got to play sharply. Sometimes you've got to you've got to speed up your own attack with a knight sack. This is just far too slow. A5. He needed the a5 square, in fact, for the queen to make this pawn threatening to get onto a2. It's it's easy in retrospect. Engines are brute forcing all the positions, but knight c4 to me seems intuitively the way to go. Okay, comments or questions on YouTube. Thanks very much.